it's not finished. There is more to do. The autonomous driven network is the future of our industry. It is the way that we need, need to develop services and capabilities moving forward. The network is becoming software. With the arrival of SDN and NFE, the application of the pattern matching and the abstraction that we so eloquently applied into the IT space now needs to be applied to the network space so that we can have intent-based operations, we can have closed-loop controls, and Aaron, we need self-healing domains. The industry does require the, a framework to understand how we implement autonomous networks. We've got to go from theory into practice. And what those requirements of AN implementation has to be about is understanding the benefits of autonomous networks, okay? What are those cross-target capabilities? How do you build the AN architecture and how do you implement the continuous AN uh, evolution? There are so many, you know, company and more and more company the executives, they make official announcement on their company strategy. We have this intent you know, uh, driven uh, autonomous network, also supported by multiple CSPs. Also like the efficiency operation, this is a very typical, you know, topic we always need to tackle or we are keep doing that. And also of green energy, the major perspectives from the, you know, using the real case, the business case. Going to make a network that consumes more the actual one, no? and we go to cloud or open run or utilization. This has to help us to be more sustainable. So we measure about these things, and really autonomous network is the answer for everything. So if we look at the blue and the um, uh, purple, so we started looking at, um, at our digital portfolio towards assurance, um, towards both service as well as resource assurance, and on how we can automatize problem and incident management, you know, um, that our network operation centers and our customer uh, support teams uh, support. But not only that, we also look at solutions to automatize the way we can uh, look at performance and quality uh, so we can predict uh, not just being reactive in terms of um, our uh, digitalization. But automation is not only about the technology and the processes. Our teams uh, and our operational teams also need to change the way uh, we do things. Um, and for this reason, in our portfolio, we have also a set of platforms that will help to democratize the automation to domain experts. So these platforms is a set of platforms that um, can do simple, low-code attended automation um, and we can expose so we can make automatization and democratize and scale it as well. So all these areas in our digital portfolio have different levels of maturity and the autonomous network levels that you guys have been discussing. At the beginning of 2021, um, based on a full analysis of the China Mobile Network, the global trends, we have put forward the goal of reaching autonomous networks level four by the end of 2025. And at the same time, a huge amount of practices has deployed on our networks with all the domains we have. And now we have deployed more than 1.76 million 5G stations serving nearly 400 million users and the total computing force has reached 9.4 EVLOS. To effectively operate the biggest network I have ever seen, so we believe the, uh, the implementation of autonomous is not, uh, only op is not an option, but the only option for us. We greatly increased our uh, practices in autonomous network. We accelerated our practices in autonomous network. Uh, we selected Zen Jordan as a benchmark for uh, our group. We put many use cases into commercial uh, use, and also we released our auton uh, autonomous network white paper. Uh, and we uh, participated our practices in uh, uh, TM Forum Catalyst uh, project. Uh, during the next two years, we will continue our uh, journey in autonomous networks and uh, we uh, are targeting, uh, uh, and we have plans and uh, we are target, uh, targeting to uh, achieve the level four target by 2025. Hopefully. Let's work together to promote the industry's prosperity. AS has developed use case and, and together with the vendor, we believe that we can deliver around 20 use cases within this year. 
And the last part about the industry collaboration, we have the paper based on ANUS, AIS AN use case and also join with the ANY paper 5.0 and also in the Catalyst program from Distinctive Customer Experience. We participated in the team forum, white paper release uh, 3, 4, 5, which is released today. And we are really happy about the team forum in this regard. So we follow the best of practice. To have a value indicator, to have a standardization contribution, to have AI use cases um, uh, library, and we also participating to the Catalyst project. If you go out, you're going to find MTN participating to so many Catalyst projects, which I see personally, one of, many of them are very useful to our business. The ultimate goal is to create a fair and ubiquitous testing and certification mechanism to make sure that we help the industry by setting a common baseline that allows everybody to talk in the same terms and to look at the state of the art in the same way. Of course, there are some challenges uh, with multi-vendor interoperability and uh, how to really uh, unite on all of this, but I'm very optimistic that the industry will achieve that. We convert all the, you know, the, 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 the core parts together, and with this basis, that every player can build their own you know, uh, 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 models. Of course, every player can keep their own part, right? And to ensure that you know, we know we, the, the, the performance of, the, uh, of the, the telecom on this model, we also think it's very necessary to build uh, open you know, test keys uh, to, to evaluate the, the, the performance, uh, the, the, uh, the, the level of the, uh, on this model, right? Uh, when we talk about the uh, large language model, you know, everyone think, okay, something must be around here, it's very close. But we think, you know, the, 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 the point is find a way to reach that, that thing, right? And we think the urban collaboration is should, it, it's, it's the, one of the right way, and, uh, and maybe it's uh, the shortest way. So uh, we should do, do it in urban collaboration. Let's go. Three, two, one, go.